All right, Sapa Sapa, uh, thank you for being with us today. Um, really great set, obviously. Um, really enjoyed that. Thank, thank you. Very thank much. you. It was very warm. Very warm. Yeah, it was very warm. It was a very sweaty, oh, good fun there. sweaty it. event, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah, absolutely. Um, so, yeah, obviously we want to sort of uh, know a bit more about you guys. Um, not individually, uh, as a band. <laughs> you don't, so, want, to, you don't <laughs> want to know us as people. No, no. Yeah. Well, I already do, unfortunately. Um, <laughs> That's a shame. <laughs> yeah. So, um, yeah, sort of like, how did the band come about? Don't all talk at once. That's great. <laughs> Probably best Go on, mate, you're the, uh, you're the guy. I've always told this story. Someone else is George. You've all heard it. Oh, well, basically, me and Mark are just in a different band. Okay. Uh, once upon a time, called Distilled. We weren't very good. Um, you were right. So we were fine. We were, fine. <laughs> it was, yeah, we were like 16, yeah. it was fine. Mm. And then yeah. we had like a break for like a year, and then we thought, let's, let's try again. So we started a band, and then it was originally Mark used to play drums, hmm. I used to play bass, and then we had some other guy playing guitar. Okay. Um, it was <laughs> terrible again. So then we. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't hold a beat, so. <laughs> Bad start. Yeah. That's an then, important thing for a drummer. Yeah. yeah. So then we found these two scallywags. Yeah, man. And um, he can hold. Towards beats, you right so. out. Yeah. Yeah. Get yeah. you off. Get you right off drums and uh, yeah. right off the it drums. Was, was I was good. actually the drummer for the first week of Sapa Sapa. You were really yeah. the yeah. drummer and singer. Well, actually, yeah. like funny enough, the song "She Never Lies" it was written before. Like I actually had the drums to that, so uh, yeah. Yeah. Drums, yeah. if you've ever listened no, to that on, no, yeah. on to look at all happened. the cameras, if you've ever heard that song, that was actually all me. <laughs> <Yeah>. Pure lies. <laughs> I wrote all the songs. Pure lies. <laughs> yeah, okay, no, I'll give you that. Okay, no, he improved this it. Time. Okay, this time, yeah. Minimally. But, um, yeah, it was, uh, it was good times. So you kind of joined these two guys, or you came in? Yeah, and, I mean, yeah, like, and... me and Marcus met at the, um, the Lamplighter. Okay. And um, awesome. he's just like, looking for a drummer. I yeah. Like, well, yeah. You, you were saying, "How's the music going?" I was like, "Yeah, good. Looking for a drummer." And you were like, "Hi." Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. I was like, "Yeah, you yeah, always exactly. say when that, you... and you never join." And then I did. And then <laughs> here we are. I just did. Yeah. yeah. And um, that was September many moons ago, 2016. Yeah. Say yeah. And uh, yeah, I went to Marcus's house with George, and they were just playing their tunes. And I was like, "I like it. It's quite cool. It's completely different back then, though. It was more." Uh, I don't know. It's more psychedelic, really. Okay. It's more yeah. guitars. We didn't even have a keyboard, did no. we? No, no. no she no never synth. lies. Didn't have no. the synth punches or. Oh the right, riff. okay. Yeah. It was just straight chords. I was uh, going to say that's like a massive part of the sound. Yeah, in yeah it is. That yeah. song, especially. Like, he yeah, bought yeah. a Korg, and I was like, "Ah, oh, you're one of those hipsters. <laughs> you're going to write. Phase, you're going to write those pop songs. <laughs> I want to be like Guns and Roses, you know." <laughs> uh, and then, and then he was like. Wake up! And I was yeah. like, okay, actually, this is amazing. There yeah. are some cool bands that play synths. Yeah, yeah. There definitely are. We are not yeah. one of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> We're fast becoming one of them. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. Hopefully. Yeah. So how did the bass get involved? Well, I actually met George through like a... We were in a pop-punk band we were, for approximately two practices and one sit-down meal together. Okay. <laughs> um, was the sit-down meal the breakup? It, it was. was. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> there was a lot of pizza thrown around. <laughs> what was the restaurant? It was a calzone, George. What was the restaurant? <laughs> it was a calzone. Right. Yeah, I think, we went, where was it? Like, Ask Italia or something? Ask Italian. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna, we we're gonna cut that. went to a practice. Yeah. And, we um, have to say Ask Italian or do we have to pay them can, right? No, yeah, you're fine. Free advertisement. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so we went to go practice and they were like, oh, we dealt books. And we were like, so we had that, you can come in like two hours. And we were like, I would known these guys maybe about three hours at this point. And they were like, mm -hmm. All right, let's uh, go for a meal. So we're like, before we get something quick, and then we end up having a sit down meal. It was an awkward. It was so awkward. No one, no one in that band was particularly like, like so. None of like, like yeah. me and George and Sarah were probably the most quiet ones. Yeah. In that band, everyone was like that. So yeah. we all just sat there, just having a romantic dinner together. <laughs> not a word was said. And then, so I stopped like replying in the chat because I was like, I didn't really want to be in a pop punk band anyway. Uh -huh. And then a month later. What were they called? We were uh, called um, Small Talk. Yeah, Small Talk. Oh, okay. Yeah. And then if only you had a really. bit of Small Talk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then I saw George on Facebook, like, oh, looking for a bass player. And then suddenly, even though I didn't want to be in the pop punk band, I didn't want to be kicked out of a pop punk band. <laughs> so I messaged him, like, oh, mate, I know I haven't been replying, but, you know, I, d I still want to be part of the band. He was like, oh, no, it's for a different band. It's indie pop. And I was like, oh, I can do that. Oh, okay. That's more of my tea. And then, oh, yeah. that sounds way worse. Hell no. <laughs> yeah. And then, yeah, yeah, so I went along. Oh, that was it. Mm -hmm. yeah. So that's sort of how you define yourselves then, in a sense, like indie pop. 
I'd say so. Yeah. yeah. I think it's it's nowadays. If we absolutely have to, if, yeah. if you want to know, just come and watch us. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. absolutely. Really yeah. Good. Yeah, watch their videos. The things that we're putting up. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Exactly. Follow on Spotify. The everything. link is down yeah. here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it will be. Yeah. We'll better edit it. Yeah. 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 Exactly. <laughs> we'll have to like, point to different places on the screen. Like, yeah. So we can put like little windows and things in. Yeah. That'd be so great. if I did that, you got to put something there. Yeah. You got to put something there. Cool. All right. It might happen. Let's make it super awkward for you. We're going to do that and put it up here. Yeah. <laughs> You're stupid. It might just be like a meme of yourself. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, so, um, yeah, so sort of is you know the sort of influences that you draw on are they like mainly sort of say like indie pop bands things that are similar to yourselves or we, we all question. listen to totally different stuff. Mm. I personally, what I do is I find a band, love mm. the band, and extract every bit of info I can about yeah. that band, yeah. even what shoe size the singer is. <laughs> <laughs> stuff like that I just get so into yeah. the details and I don't move on until I've heard every single part of Collect all of their songs used. and then I'm like okay done with them for a little while yeah, new yeah. band yeah. but it's always just I have about eight favourite bands and yeah that's, that's mm-hmm. me but you guys listen to different stuff uh, we're all into like really different music I think like yeah. I'm, probably, I'm probably personally into the music closest to what we sound like, like I love like, everything, yeah. everything and like Foles um but then, I mean, yeah, well, I listen to a lot of prog. Yeah, I'm a prog guy. I mean, I, you know, I, I grew up on metal, really, because, like, okay. well, metal wasn't, and... Wasn't good for his digestive I guess, system. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, it's great, okay. <laughs> but, um, I don't know, like, a lot of Led Zeppelin. Well, that was not really metal. That was more, I don't know, like... Well, it's classic, classic right now. Classic but it was, rock, yeah, yeah. It, it was, at yeah, the time, it was like, time, this is yeah. metal to me, you know, as yeah. a child, yeah, but... Um, you know, sitting in the car listening to like John Bonham do his, do his stuff. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's family <laughs> yeah. friendly. It, case, it yeah. could be. <laughs> yeah, do his stuff, okay. And uh, I was just like, I want to be a drummer. That's exactly like how I started drumming, really. Yeah. And, um, and then from that, I listened to a lot of like, you know, Yes, uh, Rush. Mm. Yeah. Um, and then went from that into like more tech, sort of like Tesseract, yeah. uh, Monuments, Viljata, um, Periphery, all them sort of bands. Mm. And, um, that's nothing like what we're doing. It's no, so weird and so unusual. Be yeah. Attached. Definitely, like, yeah. <laughs> but it, it it made me the the, the drummer I am today, yeah, which is yeah. really like, you know, I'm forever like, grateful for the music mm. I was in the past and like people, you know, introducing me to certain bands. Yeah. Um and like, you know, taking certain little influences from all those bands and bringing them into Sarpa, you know, yeah. in the slightest way, even though it's not like, you know, it doesn't really show for our music. Um, it really helps. Yeah. yeah. Definitely. Absolutely. Why are you? <laughs> <laughs> no, We're all looking at you and go, go on then. Because <laughs> every time I say it, these guys just rip me. Yeah, uh, there's, a, yeah. there's a reason for that. Prepare yourself <laughs> Come for on. this. Uh, it's going to happen As long live. as it's not George Michael. No. I love <laughs> <laughs> There we go. Yeah. There's nothing wrong with George Michael. But no, I listen to a lot of like, folk music. Okay. Like, uh, give us, like, uh, Singer with a guitar. That, that I would listen to that all day, every day. Yeah. Like, I'm a big sock for acoustic guitars and stuff. Yeah. Um, I never listened to any band before. I love bass so much when I play bass. I just, <laughs> yeah. so I don't, I'm not like, oh, when like, we talk about bass players, I'm always just like, oh, I like this guy and his style. I'm just like, yeah, yeah I, I, I don't really listen to bands that actually have bass players, but um, mm-hmm. I play one. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just like, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, no, folk stuff like Seth Layton is probably my biggest yeah. ultimate idol. Do you think you're sort of like, because you've got quite obviously an eclectic taste as a group, do you think that sort of like contributes? Because your sound, I mean, Yes, you are within that sort of indie pop genre, but you're doing things like quite differently to the way a lot of other other bands in the genre are doing at the moment. I think that's sort of like, yes, it's going towards your sort of success in a sense. Actually, you you know you're becoming successful based on that. I think. Do you think that that sort of that eclectic taste is really the you know a lot of the reason why you're you're able to do those things I, so differently? I yes. think we we write quite pop structures. Mm. Our songs are structured like pop songs. Yeah. Um, but we actually don't just do, you know, what, four chords we do sometimes, disclaimer. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> we don't just, we try and make, like, we'll write a song and then it'll be like, right, we did that last time, so we've got to do something different this time. We try and do something different every time. Yeah. And we just try and change it up in every way we can, whether it be vocals, bass line, drums, or even like a backing sound. We try and just make Facts it completely different. Mm-hmm. I think we just we're, we're just trying our best not to fall in like a trap of like yeah. Yeah. boxing yourself in too much and just thinking you know we are we're a pop we're a pop band or we're a synth band or you know, yeah, yeah. We, we really don't sit like we have 
as as mates, we have arguments at least eight times a day. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, it'll be like, hey guys, friendly message in the chat. I've got an idea. And everyone's like, no, I hate that idea. You're the worst. And I think that's really good for the band. In a strange way, it is because we're so brutal with each other yeah. that the, the crap doesn't fall through with us. So right. who's the most brutal? There's <clears throat> got to be one of you. Is that me? No, come on. I, actually, I guess so. Yeah, maybe. Well, maybe you're just, pretty brutal, actually. Yeah, well, only because, like, you know, we, like whenever we like raise our opinions, it's because we want the better for the band. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're yeah. not doing it in, like a yeah. spiteful. Well, mine's for like, my like, image. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, of course. Just want to be the super but, cool one. Yeah, that's yeah, it. Really cool. Secondly, yeah, it's for the band, I guess. Yeah, but um, no, we just want what's best, don't we? Yeah, yeah, really. So. And sometimes we we have ideas, and they don't quite match each other's ideas, yeah. and yeah. we get very. Which comes back to the different types of genres, I guess, because you mm. you sort of have a sound in your head, and then when you you don't hear that, you sort of like, oh, let's work yeah. on that a little bit. Or I think with us, we'll, we'll sometimes like write the first bar of a song, and we'll be like, oh, yeah. cool, and then we've all got ideas of where that bar goes. Yeah, yeah. yeah and then when it doesn't go the way you were like, you're like, no. Yeah. <laughs> and begrudgingly yeah. playing your part, like, well, my way would have been better. Yeah. With well, a copy face. Yeah. 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 This would have been a platinum hit if I wrote it. <laughs> I was actually doing a bass signature, don't read into that. Could have been platinum <laughs> hit. So do you think, um, you know, like, <laughs> right, is, is there certain people who, like, agree with each other more? Or is there, like... We've got yeah. two little clans, you know, me and Charlie, yeah. we've got George. We sometimes okay. have duo Definitely. fights. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, Change, sometimes yeah. it changes. That's mm. the problem with the even number. Yeah. So we've got no like, deciding vote, basically. No, we don't. Yeah. Yeah. George's well, mum. Yeah, George's mum. Hello, Kerry. Well. Thank you for shout the vote. Out. Big shout out. Well, well, I don't know, because, like... Me, George, and Ethan are Pokemon Masters now. So okay. uh, Mark yeah. is the, uh, yeah. is the outsider, Mark. really. He's the outsider. Yeah. God damn you know, right. that's, that's what we do with our time. Absolutely. We write music and play Pokemon, apart from Mark. Rock and roll. So, you know, mm. Fortnite all day, come on. Fortnite all day. <laughs> <laughs> He's like yeah, a 13-year-old boy. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Can we rewind that? Can we edit it so it goes back as soon as he says that to him going, we're Pokemon Masters. <laughs> <laughs> Please do that. It's going to happen. Um, okay. Right? So, yeah, obviously, like, we, um, uh, yeah, I think obviously, like, it's you, you're young guys, and you know, I think is was music something you were always interested in? I mean, like, you know, when yeah, when you sort of like you popped out and said you said I want to play <laughs> play yeah. an instrument. I think yeah. Yeah. I think before yeah. I even knew it. Like, yeah. I used to be walking around Toys R Us with my parents. You know, they had the uh, the keyboards everywhere. Mm. I'd you just go up to it and she'd be like. Yeah. And I'd try and just do something like din, 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 Similar din, to how you din, play din. these days, really. <laughs> yeah. Some would say better. <laughs> if you master it first time, there's no need to improve. You know what I mean? But I yeah, I've always just kind of loved hitting stuff, annoying people, just making sounds, especially in class, just like I bet you annoyed everyone in the world. No. I tell you what, no, you it, was, it was the people folk. who weren't drummers who used to tap on tables. They were the most annoying ones. Because yeah. like, when you're a drummer, you know like, you know, velocities and you know like someone will hear that next to you and it might be like, you know, annoyed. But, um, <laughs> you know, other, other people, you know, the outsiders, they, uh, they're just like, <laughs> so, <laughs> so loud, like, what are you doing? It's so annoying. Yeah. Trying to get but, involved in your beats. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. I hate it when people have straight fingers like that and they do that with the air guitar. Yeah. It's like, what chord is yeah. that? Come on! <laughs> you can probably tell me. A super bar chord. <laughs> <laughs> Whole hand bar. Depends yeah. what tuning your guitar's in. <laughs> so, yeah. Fuck. I could have dropped that on you. <laughs> <laughs> Glad you didn't. Let's move on. Edit out. No, I'm so yeah. I'm I'm sort of like you know I'm I'm someone who sort of listened to your music you know prior to obviously you coming on and working with Audio Stage and um, thank you very much. You know I, I absolutely love what you do. I think I, I came to I think one of your first gigs. And I have your your Which hand drawn T shirt. Oh really? Oh, that was wow. still have that. The Albion bar. Albion yeah, bar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And I came down to that, and, and like I just remember being like really sort of like blown away by what you, what you were sort of doing, and I, I remember you guys coming up and saying. Yeah, this is this is really terrible. We played a terrible game. <laughs> yeah. and I really hate it. To be fair, the snare drum did break in half. In the yeah, second yeah. song, the snare drum break, the synth yeah. broke, and then just before we're meant to play, I the broke. bass amp uh, <laughs> yeah. blew up. So we had to go back and grab the bass amp. So yeah. the whole gig was just filled with like. <laughs> I sat and spent about yeah. four hours hand drawing all those t-shirts, yeah. and the plan was to do about a hundred. Mm. I did about 
16 and I was like okay nope none of that so we just threw them out yeah. for free my plan is to sell that when you uh, make it yeah <laughs> it's actually in a frame <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's actually mint probably, condition yeah, it's gonna be yeah, yeah. never worn <laughs> totally, yeah. yeah never worn for a reason yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly yeah, yeah but I'm so, you know obviously as I say I'm you know I'm I'm, I'm a fan you know absolutely cool. and um, Thank you. you know we Thanks. sort of um, I think that, you know we we're obviously local to each other. Do you think there's anyone in the scene sort of right now that, um, you know, I mean, I'm, I'm sort of talking like UK scene that you sort of, um, you know, can sort of ascribe to and someone you actually like sort of want to work with and like maybe tour with or anything like that? Anything that interests you with those sorts of bands? We've been touring with the Scruff Lads over from also, Bedford. Yeah. They're awesome. like some of the nicest human beings you'll ever meet in your life. They rock the stage and when... On the rare occasion they play before us, we watch them and we're like, gotta follow that up. Yeah. <laughs> Only Ethan can even come close to yeah, battling man. with that stage presence. <laughs> they're, they're going for it, like smash stuff up and stuff. Um, so we have worked with them, but in terms of if we want to, um, I, I, the thing is, I'd like to say things like Marmosets, but that would just not work. <laughs> like we, yeah. Can you imagine us supporting them? Everyone yeah. would be like. Oh, <laughs> indie pop. <laughs> cool. The thing, the thing, like obviously, I asked you that question. I think anything, you know, we say anything's possible. I think that the, the way that the industry is sort of developing, it's like really interesting because you go to gigs now and like you see a variety of music. You do. Yeah. Whereas I think like you know, before I mean, people used to sort of like get their click. Mm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And I think that 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 now I think you guys are sort of like you're actually a sort of a genre that is. Very multifaceted and like think, that's what we try and do. Yeah, I, I yeah, think we try and yeah. put a different cool. genre twist. Yeah, that's why we had, hate saying our genre because it's like yeah, yeah. yeah. we've had like a lot yeah. of different people yeah. like people come up to us. We played this one gig. I can't remember where it was, but um, it was like a proper biker bar. Yeah, uh, and there was like a guy turned up on a trike and all their like fully tattooed leather jackets, everything. And we're like there, like four indie pop kids with like real tight jeans on. Like, oh no! Was so, did you say a trike? Yeah, yeah. did you not remember the trike? Oh, as my in a, God. a motor um, trike? Yeah, motor or, 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 or like a little jigsaw <laughs> trike. <laughs> That's that what was, I'm um, picturing. I don't remember that guy. Peter from Toys R Us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ding 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 ding. Raps bar. Raps bar. Yeah. So it was like a proper. And like, and we're like, oh my god! So then we we played, and we're like, right, we're full. We're like, okay, we just need to perform and, and get the and hell out like, of here. Look Straight as away. heavy <laughs> as rocky as we can. So we played our set, and then like, loads of them just kept coming out to us. Like, I don't normally like pop music, but that was really good. And it was yeah. like, oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, it's a really good compliment because we get, you know, you're not used to it. Really, you're not used to um, going to a different genre mm. like completely, not expecting anyone to actually care sort of yeah. thing, you know, because you know, when you went when you went to gigs like, when you were younger, you'd. Uh, <laughs> You'd watch certain bands you like, but you'd never really venture out of that. Mm. So yeah, it's quite cool. We get super eclectic, like people saying, "Like, oh, you sound like this, you oh, sound like that." Like the some of them are range. like, "What? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> where have you heard that?" No, yeah, absolutely. They're yeah. still in like Eric Clapton. It's and then yeah, yeah. Like, everything ever seen, <laughs> and then Maroon and Five, and it's just like, yeah, that's, Maroon Five. That was a recent one. I was that, like, that was a couple of times. I'll actually, take yeah. that. I'll that's take like, that. That's they're a pretty cool band. Like, yeah, yeah, they're pretty good singer. Thanks, guys. It's yeah. great. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. So, have you sort of like got? Obviously, we talk about like you know other bands that you want to sort of gig with, but are there other people that you, um, you know, that you might want to like collaborate with in a sense? Like, is there artists out there that you think to yourself like, oh, I'd love to have such and such come and sing with us, or like a rapper, or all these sorts of things? Do you know How what I mean? big like, are we talking? We're like? talking like the sky's the limit. Are they? So they can they be yeah, dead, dead or alive? Done. Uh, dead or alive, but I prefer alive. So maybe we could hook. <laughs> yeah. it I up. generally prefer like, alive. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> they don't sing very well when they're dead. No, exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Michael Jackson does. But yeah. yeah, that's true. He keeps pumping singles out. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> How? Yeah, I was gonna say I think what we can definitely piece. agree on is uh, Kevin Parker. Yeah, okay. damn right. If you watch this ever, I love you. Yeah, <laughs> please, please. Oh God, he's, 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 he's got such a you know such a mind for music. Mm. Yeah, it'd be incredible just to see how he does it. Like yeah. up front, up close and personal. Yeah. Months of isolation. Yeah. yeah, no friends. Yeah, I'm gonna cut off a lot of the world. Alcohol. Yeah, mm. Alex Turner for me. Yeah, I mean, yeah. He's gone a bit mad. He's gone a bit mental, days. yeah. yeah I'm going to go mad. We're all going to go mad. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's the plan. You've got to get there eventually. Like, yeah, we'll we all, we all, we all go mad. Yeah. Otherwise, we go mad. I mean, I guess everything, everything would In be... In a bad also, way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Quite close. Like, they've got a very, like, indie sound, but they've also very much taken things from the indie sound very much out of the box. Mm. So, 
That'd be interesting. What are we thinking? Not bands. I not was bands. I was thinking yeah. like Eminem on a track. Eminem, that'd be that'd pretty cool, wouldn't it? Uh, oh, I don't know. I I would really like to do something with like. I know you're probably gonna give me shit for this, but like, <laughs> <Go on. laughs> sitting your like someone from the folk, because like one thing I've noticed about folk is like musically, it's never like normally gonna <laughs> blow you away. Like it's yeah. never gonna be like, oh, he's the best of this. But like lyrically, like they like tell a story within yeah. a song, and like that's oh, really I did cool. Actually like, like that song you played me. I'll, yeah, exactly. I'll like like they they will pick like a moment in history, like a battle, blah blah blah, that you would never heard of. Right? And now suddenly I'm an expert on like a, a battle that happened in Germany like 500 years ago because I've like watched those folk songs on it. I'm like. I think that's really cool. It's Don't not, worry, this is not going to happen. Yeah. So, semi-educational so you know. alongside yeah, being like... Yeah, like, like you know, yeah, learning yeah. while yeah. playing music. That's yeah, pretty cool, yeah. yeah. It's, uh, it's an audience for it, but not us. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think, not us. Not yeah. yourselves. Yeah. Archaeologists, yeah. historians... <laughs> Paleontologists, seventy yeah. plus. <laughs> 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 yeah, now, that's awesome. So, like, obviously, where you are now, I mean, sort of, what are your, I suppose, immediate goals? What do you want to achieve? You know, let's say within the next year. Yeah. Um, I think if we could earn enough money that we don't have to eat rice regularly <laughs> would yeah. be a great don't lie stone. don't lie you, rice is way too healthy <laughs> <laughs> we eat cheesy chips that's we all do. we yeah. eat a we lot. eat carbs Chicken carbs nuggets. carbs and carbs and we're gonna die young yeah and it's, you're, it's all, fun. you're all slim lads mm. Like, I don't, know how, get I don't know how. Yeah. Have you ever noticed I wear slowly. baggy clothing? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's getting somewhere. I think, I think the next year, I think... I, I think it'd be like if we can... Yeah, yeah I think festivals the big one. Like, I'd love to go to like, ones, yeah. Reading and Leeds or like Glastonbury or something like that. Mm. That'd be amazing. I think also to maybe get back out to Europe and go yeah. like... Yeah. And yeah, like, yeah, obviously yeah, we definitely. went over to Germany earlier this year. And then to go over and but maybe go like Amsterdam, do a bit of France, do a bit of Germany, yeah. you know, just mm -hmm. a, even if they're like small, like 20, 30 venue, cab venues or whatever, like pubs, just to go abroad again and like get more of my music. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, probably do an EP, that'd be pretty cool. I'd like to go that to Japan, be. not in the next year, but just generally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, Japan is crazy. Like, that's they, what I've heard. Like, it's literally so many like, stories. I think you could play anything. Yeah. You could go out there and play the pan pipes, and you'd get like a thousand people come and watch you. <laughs> Finally, like, yeah, yeah, demand yeah. really? my talent. Yeah, honestly, <laughs> it's a crazy, crazy place. Like, so you're yeah. telling me if you go out and tell historical battle poems, you, you could get do really well. Wow, yeah. absolutely. I think what you're, a place. you're headed in the wrong direction. <laughs> I agree. I've got a plan. <laughs> 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 Wouldn't it be really funny if you made it large doing that? <laughs> <laughs> we all look back on this video Only like, ha, oh, Should oh dear. Battle poems. <laughs> I'm still eating cheesy chips. You're eating <laughs> kale. 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 <laughs> kale. <laughs> Yippee. <laughs> I've made it. A bowl of kale. <laughs> Mum, <laughs> people say like swimming pools made of gold, a sauna, oh my God. Kale. Like, a model for a wife, a bowl of kale. That'll do. Should I do a wow. of these? Ethan, you're going to make it very gone, soon. Man. Very soon. <laughs> Promise you know me. you can buy a bowl of kale for like <laughs> say you know less than three quid. I'll get you a bowl of kale, mate. Don't worry. Like, if it's all you ever really wanted. I hate you guys so much. <laughs> 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 oh god. <sighs> so apart from kale, <laughs> what are the you know long term I suppose oh, long term goals? I mean obviously everyone's long term goal as a musician is to yeah have the huge house and yeah. all of kale. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I mean you know <laughs> Oh god. You know, is this do you, you know we sort of I mean I suppose we're we're in the business of like, you know, we want things to stand the test of time and last a long time. Yeah. Do you believe, you know, like, do you, is that what you sort of want? Is your, do you think you'll, you'll develop as a band? Do you think you'll try and stay true to your roots and try and do the sort of Definitely. same I, mean, I feel like, I, I think everyone would say yes to that question. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. If you'd have asked Arctic Monkeys out there, they'd have probably said yes. But yeah. now he's doing like albums about the moon and stuff. And exactly. everyone's like, where's all the songs about nightclubs? Well, he doesn't go to English nightclubs anymore. Yeah. Yeah. And he we'll goes to, to the moon. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, we're going to look back in... 30 years and we're going to be popping out songs about bowls of kale and people Absolutely. are going to be like yeah. where are your original well that's our lives now <laughs> <laughs> people have all <laughs> I don't know but I'd like to always just stay young mm. yeah healthy and write 
good songs with my pals. Yeah, I think, and hopefully we don't turn into an arrogant <laughs> Kay Leaders. <Lita's. laughs> no, <laughs> I, th- I think just to have one album that I can be super proud of. So even yeah. if then after that it goes downhill, we all get become bankers and you get wives and kids or whatever. And then you the kids bankers. are like, you used to be fun. <laughs> and I'm like, I did a good album once and then rub that in their face. Just <laughs> little bitches. That's great parents. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. yeah, just one good album. Basically yeah. is all I want. Yeah. We all have to be bankers. <laughs> I'm terrible. With I'm well, terrible with numbers. <laughs> I can bank you, and you can bank me. Sorry. <laughs> wow. Bank me off. <laughs> I thought we were playing the weakest link for a second. <laughs> wow. We'll confirm. Sap us up for a bunch of bankers. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, that's awesome. So yeah, I mean, you know, we're sort of. I think you know, it, it seems pretty definitive. I suppose. Mm. You know, I think you. You're headed in the right direction, and it's it's Thank amazing you. to see. And you know, you're such a refreshing, young, interesting band. So like, I'm su- yeah, super excited to see where you sort of go with it. Basically, Thank we you have no it. idea. Yeah, yeah no, no idea at all. No, absolutely. It's been honestly, it's been an absolute pleasure. And before I sort of wrap it up, we want to know where we can find you. So, cool. Facebook's Twitter, Instagram. What what are they? Sapa Sapa music on all of them basically. On all yeah, of them. Sapa yeah. Sapa music. Trademark, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, in, Twitter. done, all over. And yeah. if you want to know where we are right now, we're sat here. So. Yeah. And then also, where can we find your music? Spotify, YouTube. ITunes. Spotify's a good one. iTunes is iTunes still a thing? Yeah, yeah. iTunes is. I checked the other day. You can buy Apple it for ninety nine p. Really? There you go. Awesome. Um, want to help us out? Contribute. You, yeah. Groove music. You know, Groove if you're music. if you're interested. Oh, yeah. you want all the streaming services? Yeah. Yeah. Or if you're I super are, yeah. old fashioned, you can buy the sheet music from your local market. <laughs> <laughs> and imagine. The music. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. No, that's yeah. awesome. So yeah, we can listen to you on Spotify, YouTube. Obviously, buy you on iTunes. Um, you got some new stuff hopefully coming out, have you? Oh yeah, 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 yeah absolutely. Yeah. And we'll be able to catch that at gigs as well. You will, yes, yeah, awesome. We're backlogged. We got songs we wrote two years ago coming out now, and then we got songs yeah. all over, and we got songs we're writing now coming out. It's just all coming out. I'm coming out <laughs> right now. <laughs> Not really. I love you, darling. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you got the hint. Okay. Good. Right. So yeah, it's been an absolute pleasure having you, lads. Um, yeah, you've been fantastic all the way. Um, really enjoyed your music. Obviously, I'm, I'm sure everyone else who listens to it will. Um, you know, we'll, we'll obviously keep up to date with you on your Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Um, listen to all the new releases. Um, and yeah. It's been great having you. Thanks a lot for having us, man. Awesome. Thank you. Thank Thanks you a lot, dude. Yeah. Thank you so Cheers. much. All Attack minutes. of the hands. <laughs> right. I, I, can do that. <laughs> I feel like, uh, so who who has the best accents? Like, Mark, is it this Mark? guy. Oh, yeah. His, his yeah. vocal ability yeah, across the board is just real yeah. fucking annoyingly good. Charlie, yeah. Charlie, you got to be the summer yeah. signing, mate. Actually, Ethan's going to be my summer signing if we want okay. to roll the camera. Oh, okay. Are the cameras on? Yeah, yeah. Alright, it's good. So, um... Where am I from? Where's my, what's my, what's, what's, Wherever what's... you want. So we're proper happy to get uh, signed on a deadline day. We've got uh, Whippy here. Coming from... Um... Australia. <laughs> He's coming from Australia, FC, um, on, on a free transfer. How are you looking forward to the season? Australian. <laughs> oh yeah, it's going to be real good, mate, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's going to be fantastic. Um, as a football player, obviously, he's been eating a lot of kale, um, making sure that his diet's good for the new season. None of that cheesy chip shite, eh? Come on, lad. <laughs> it's a wrap. It's a wrap. <laughs>